Ford's Kentucky truck factory averting another UAW strike here with the very latest is Yahoo Finance's Praz, Submarinian Praz. Hey, so yeah, so strike averted, like you mentioned, there was this local UAW laws that were not necessarily being signed off on uh, with the UAW and Ford. Uh, UAW on Friday threatened that they would strike this plant on Friday if they didn't get these local laws kind of signed off on it, and then they did. It's very interesting because this was that same plant that had a stand-up strike uh, during the October strikes, and that was a big deal for Ford, the most profitable plant there. So good news for Ford, good news for the UAW, but there's also a number of, of other plants, several other plants across the, U, across the country, UAW plants that don't have local laws sort of signed on, uh, UAW agreements, and there's 19 other Ford plants that have expired agreements. So this issue could pick up again, but I think this is more of a political sort of gamesmanship mm. here. Well, I was going to say, have we gotten any indication from the union that something else might be, I mean, this one was kind of a surprise one, right? Right, right. But have we gotten any hints from the union about what, what their strategy is going forward? No, I mean, other than mentioning the fact that there are 19 other right. plants, Ford Oh, so plants. they, they yes, hinted this is, at that. This is okay. their information. There are 19 other Ford plants, in addition to Stellantis and GM plants that haven't had these local agreements signed off. And it's stuff like ergonomics and the number of nurses at a plant, right? These are the things that we're talking about, uh, separate from the major sort of uh, national agreements. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah. Well, stay tuned, in other words. Thanks, Pros. Mm -hmm. Appreciate it.